Hello, this is Taki. So this is your invitation to the Womb Wisdom Training in Portugal, May 29th through June 2nd. And I want to tell you a little bit about it so you know what you can expect. We're going to be going into shadow work. Um, the reason why is because we carry all kinds of baggage and layers and masks and things that are not us. That is not our true self. And we do that and we keep looking out for borrowed paint to paint our canvas with of who we are as a woman, what we should be like, look like, act like, um, what, what it means to be fulfilled and instead of looking in. Um, and that's because through all these layers, sometimes it's difficult to know who really am I as a woman. And so this group is specifically going to go into that who am I as a woman? What is my unique fragrance as a woman? And my unique gift to humanity for existing in this body, in this woman's body. And one of the uh, main ways we're going to do that is through archetypal work. And so um, there's different energies that are present in our monthly uh, existence by having a a womb by having a menstrual cycle um, this creates our connection to certain archetypes and so that doesn't mean that we have to look this way and that way or that it, it, this archetype is this way and therefore I'm going to go copy it but what happens when I open myself up and allow this energy to flow through me how then is it lived by me and that can look very different from one person to another. So let's take, for example, a, a classic archetype, the great mother. So how the great mother energy might flow through me can look very different than how it would look through my mother, for example, or through you. So um, to embrace that we have all these different facets and some of them are easier for us to access and are more our home base, more our natural way of being and some of them are scary or triggering or um, just foreign, unknown. And so to broaden, make more whole, make more complete ourselves as women and what it means to be feminine, what it means to be in this body, what it means to have a cycle, and what it means to be in sisterhood. So instead of competing with other women or putting or having judgments, putting them down about like, oh, she's like that, and oh, I don't like that because I don't embrace it in me, or um, oh, she's like that, oh, I wish I had that. Well, actually, I can have access to that. So whichever way the projection goes, um, to drop that and to support each other to become more full, more whole as women empowered, living their full potential in life, in everyday life, at home, shopping, at work, in the office, with the kids. Yes, in those moments. So that's my proposal. It, for me, it is the one group that I wish that every woman would go through so that she can recognize herself in her fullness and in her full potential. So if this calls you, if this moves something in you, then I invite you to read more about the details in the, the link somewhere below or in the comments um, and uh, to register. So it's already um, working out to be a beautiful journey of women coming from different parts of the world. And it's a journey that of alone together, that you're in it for yourself and yet in the sisterhood circle. Um, so it's a, it's a beautiful experience and it is there to change your life in a way that you can then be more you in your everyday life. So that is the, the ultimate aim is that you can live your truth and you can live in freedom. That's the whole thing. So, if this moves you, then I look forward to meeting you uh, May 29th through June 2nd in Portugal for the Womb Wisdom Training. Thank you, sister.